again. It is Shucky Noise. And look, we can actually use it, uh, because it's normal flying. We can make it pure flying. Uh, what is your ability? <sighs> oh my god. Holy shit. Here's the funny thing. I was thinking, oh man, it'd be weird if that Blastoise, when we go to evolve, the War Turtle later has huge power or something like crazy. We got a huge power, Shucky! Let's go! In the last episode, we buckled in and decided it was time to take on the gym. But only after going to the Burn the Tower, meeting Yuzine, fighting our rival, and watching the legendaries run off into the night. And then we left the tower, and it was gym time, and easily acquired our fifth badge of our run. And then after some battles and trying to get some more encounters, we finally arrived in Olivine and went right to the lighthouse, where we battled some trainers and unfortunately lost our starter to a Wobbuffet. Rest in peace, there's now a space in our heart, and we will miss you. And then lastly, after talking to Jasmine and deciding it is time to go to Scenewood, we tried to get one more encounter, but I kind of ran away from it on accident. So yeah, that happened. But, can we turn this bad luck around and get this run back on track to amazingness? Watch and find out. Like if you enjoy. Hello YouTube, it is I, Dragon Team, the local Dragon VTBB streamer, and today it's episode 6 of our solo Heart Gold Nuzlocke Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge, where uh, we're going to try and cross the ocean, maybe get, you know, a couple more encounters if we're lucky, fight the gym, try and get another static, Fly back to Olivine, go up the lighthouse, do that, possibly fight Jasmine, get two gems in one episode. We'll see if we get lucky. Uh, so, if you didn't see last week's episode, which if you did, go watch that now. Or if you saw the recap, you kind of saw what happened last time. Uh, so, yeah, let's just go over to this PC real quick, and let, let, let's just see the, the heartbreak. Alright, we, we, we lost Juliet, like, long, long ago, which, meh, I'm not that worried about. We lost our starter! Void! The Palkia that we had with us ever since day one that we started this journey. And we lost it to a Wobbuffet. Because I thought, in my naive brain, oh, I can knock it out. It won't be that difficult. I can knock it out and move on. No worries. No. No, I... I'm, I'm dumb. It lived. It mirror-coded me. And... Yeah. Then we get the counter after that, and it just forfeit that, so... Yeah. Yeah. So... Yeah, that's what happened last time. Although we did get a badge, so... It's not all bad. So yeah, that's what we're going to be doing uh, in today's episode, is trying to get another badge or two, get some more counters, and hopefully not lose any more mons, because when we go to, to fight Chuck, I will have to bump everyone up. Because Chuck's ace is at 31. Our highest is Taco at uh, 27. So we'll have to bump everyone up. Uh, to at least, I would, I would say either 30 or 31, just have like a decent chance at, you know, winning. Um, 
Uh, but yeah, so... We also decided to put on, a uh, light bulb, the lantern, which... For anyone that saw our fire red run... That actually kind of helped us out. <laughs> lantern was on our winning team for fire red. So... We, we get it, they return, so I'm happy about it. It just kind of sucks that its ability is arena trap. So... Yeah. It, it's gonna be good if there's like a roaming legendary that's or anyone that tries to like you know run away or teleport or whatever. Awesome. And it's gonna be great for that. Anything else? Not so much. But uh, yeah. So without any further ado, let us proceed to the water because we can now progress. So we tried to get our encounter here last time, which I believe was a Tangela. Which, if we, we, if we could have got lucky and, uh, see this is literally what we had last time. Which I did the same thing, like, by accident last time. I mean, last time it was an accident, that time it was, I, I had to run. Um, thank god we didn't get skinny last time because Jesus Christ. Uh, my god, is an encounter central. Jesus. Do I have any repels? I need to see if I have any repels. I got one. Just one. I mean, it's better than nothing. Better than nothing. Uh, but if we go into another... Ooh, another route. So we can, hopefully we can get something good here. Uh, oh yeah, duh, head repel on. Duh. Hollow wax, not bad, not bad. Uh, we get a water stone. We could get our. That's actually not a bad ability. Holy crap! Wave because thanks to light bulb being our easy e easy to get to catch mons with thanks to thunder wave we can get through the uh, yet another water type we are now in the we are now misty wait so we got polywag with the drizzle not bad at all honestly not not bad at all. Uh, let's just name you Frogger. Oh, Frogger, there we go. So, we have yet another <laughs> Watcher tonight. Uh, my goodness. Oh, that's funny. Why do you have a hobo? Excuse me. Uh, no thank you. No thank you. Uh, I mean, with a bite. Woo! I was hoping for the flinch, because anyone that would have brought in probably would have died. Uh, okay, Aerosmith, I'm gonna need you to agent power. Thank you. Now, I know, I know what you're thinking. Why didn't I? I guess this is, I guess I were seen with uh, encounter. <laughs> I mean, hey, it's a starter. It has intimidate. <clears throat> oh my god! Oh my god! It has intimidate. It's actually not bad at all. 
Okay, you should live a water gun. Oh, yeah. Uh, you, you should live one more. There we go. In the red. Paralyzed. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes! <laughs> I mean, uh, we won't really know what ability Blastoise will have when it evolves later. Which I think after we do Chuck, um, uh, actually, let me look up, um, let me look up, uh, Jasmine, because we're going to do Chuck first, then Jasmine, and then Price. Well, we'll do Price after we do the, uh, Lake of Rage, get our shiny. Uh, but Jasmine, what is your... Uh, uh, your highest is 35. So, yeah, I, I think bringing everyone up to probably 30, 31 would probably be good. Like, like, like a nice, nice even area, you know? Uh, let's see, War Turtle. See, so you're probably gonna be our water. So, we're, we'll, we'll name you Leo. After the Ninja Turtle. Oh my god, I'm so happy we did not have that red eyes, because holy shit nugget. Oh my god. I'm so happy we did not encounter that, because that would have been horrifically bad. Okay, so let's just make sure. Oh. Uh, yeah, let's just move you. Yeah, not, not in the death box, okay. Uh, let's see, summary. We're at 41. And see what city. Okay, good. Good. It's still crazy that that Wartel has, uh, has intimidate for its ability. Which isn't bad, it's really not. Doing pharmacy. Thank you. Okay, so you're the pushing guy that we talk, gotta talk to. Are you the one that gives us static, Shucky? Hey, you're not the one that gives us Shucky. Uh, what are you? You, uh, do, 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 do. is it you or is it all the way up north? Uh, okay, uh, let's put one up. So I think this one should be Shucky. Uh, what are they gonna put? Uh, we'll put Doom Slayer up. Uh, just temporarily no, no layout change. It's gonna stay the same. Just gonna see what this Mon is over here. Ah. Hey, okay, who did we get? Ooh, we got a Pidgeot by the look of things. It is Shucky Noise. And look, we can actually use it, uh, because it's normal flying. We can make it pure flying. Uh, what is your ability? 
Oh. My. God. Holy. Shit. Here's a funny thing. I was thinking, oh man, it'd be weird if that Blastoise, when we would evolve the War Turtle later, has siege power or something like crazy. We got a huge power, Shucky! Let's go! Put, uh, put fly on you, other more physical moves, and you are a fucking menace to society, and I love it! Uh, up in defense, low in speed. Eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
Probably don't. Alright, well, that's not good. Devil protect in a row? Die. Stop protecting. Stop protecting. Okay, so... That's that. Yeah, because we gotta talk to that guy like that. Uh... No. Oh, we need to check out, um... We need to check out, uh, Merrimack's, uh, ability real quick. Which is... I mean, it's not bad, because it's the same thing as Doom Slayer. Um... Which kind of sucks, not gonna <laughs> not gonna lie. Um... Because if it's poisoned, rough. If it's burned, that's really bad because it cuts our attack and it's just awful. So, not the greatest. If... Slugma, what? Uh, spoink. Got a mecho, easy. Alright, so we'll go out here real quick, come back in to, uh, fight Chuck. Uh, so yeah, yeah, so. So we gotta do the, uh, the obligatory, uh, weekly thanks for, uh, all the, all the support on the, uh, the second channel. So much, much appreciated, you guys are fucking awesome, so thank you, thank you, thank you. Much, much appreciated. Got to get that out of the way before I, before I forget about it. Uh, but yeah, so... Last week, uh, the live-action uh, Halo uh, started airing in. Already! People are upset with it already. For God knows why. Because only, only two episodes are, are out, and people are just like... Oh, they didn't learn anything... Uh, they didn't learn anything from season one. Like, man, they, it, it's not a good, it's not good. Nothing about it is good. It's like, it's like, but it's, it's only been one episode. No, it's only two episodes. Like, what, what are you expecting? It, it's just... It's two episodes, and it's like it's actually doing pretty good. Like I, I, I like it. It's like hell. Like Cortana looks even like really good. Like much better than season one. It's like if, if you ask me, I honestly think Cortana looks way better. Like, and granted, it's like they said, it's only two episodes out. People are basing the entire season on only two episodes, and it's like. Why? It's just... Wait, wait till it's all out, and then come back and be like... Okay, uh, you are annoying! Okay, well, it's not gonna matter, because we're asleep anyway. And you are pure water. Oh my god! I mean, we can heal, so I'm not that up upset about it. Not because water. I, I have to swap out the king. Ha-ha! Why... See, this is why I'm not gonna evolve into a Politoed. Mainly because of that. Mainly because of that reason there, because it's like, oh, Parish Song. Great. Great move. Uh, what is that? Oh, that's Fly. 
Awesome. Thank you. I would have to assume you're probably Chuck's wife. I would have to assume. Uh, but yeah. No mons gone. That is number five. So now we can fly all the way back to Olivine. It's a big, big yay. Uh, so we'll do this. We'll fight using. Uh, we don't, I don't think it'd be that bad. Because we have an answer! We're in Jolteon! <laughs> uh, Wilmer, you are pure water. Because, like, I... See, here's the funny thing. I always think that Politoed is, like, water rock, but it's always pure water. And I always think that... Wilmer... Because I know Waylord. Oh no, Waymore and Waylar are all just pure water. They're not water flying. This is pure water. And every time I, I, I learn that, I'm like, oh. It's like, man, that's impressive. Like, I would not have figured that at all. And it's just like, hey, you <laughs> learned this already, idiot. Um, but, yeah. So... Back to back to the Halo talk. Um, so I guess episode three came out yesterday, and uh, I'll probably be watching it that later uh, because I'm I'm excited for it. Like this season, it's like oh man, I wonder what's gonna happen on Reach. I wonder what's gonna happen when the Covenant come there and just destroy everything. But it's like. I, I'm trying to keep my optimism as high as I can, even though everyone else is, like, not happy with it. <laughs> Mainly because, like, oh, Master Chief has his helmet off a lot. If you read, if you read the books, and you play the games, you'll know he has the helmet off as well. But I guess people just seem to forget that, but... Yeah, the first episode so far, like, they're really good. I'm enjoying it. Cannot wait for, like, the rest of them to come out, so it can actually be, like... I, I just can't wait. I'm, 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 I like it. Which, again, I can actually be glad that Cortana looks way, way better. Simply because... I, I think that's, like, my main issue with... In season one was the fact that Cortana's like in being CG just looked weird. Like the more you looked at it, it, like you like your brain just went it it seems fine. But there's a weird thing about it that my brain is telling me it's just uncanny and it doesn't feel right. Uh so it's like other than that it's like Everything about it was awesome. I, I like it. It was fantastic. So now that, uh, you know, Rattana is like more, like, actually should be. Love it. So good. Fantastic. Uh, I, I, I cannot wait. For like the rest of episodes to come out, see what's gonna happen, and it's gonna be just a good, good time. Okay, and then we'll take our dactyl back out. Because we will need you. Okay, we'll go back up to the lighthouse. Talk to Jasmine, get her to go back to the to the gym, and hopefully get lucky enough to get another badge. There you go. There's your there's your medicine. Yay! 
now we'll take the elevator back down again. Move on over to the gym. Which I think we might have another rival fight. Uh, not entirely sure. Warden Baba? Oh my god, we get to the Safari Zone? <clears throat> Oh my god. This is fantastic. Can we get ultra balls now? Noise. Uh, high potion, we'll get six of those. Okay. Uh, what we'll actually do now is... Let me look up, uh, the level for price, because Jasmine's highest is 35. Uh, Harper Gold Soul Silver... Your highest is 34. How does Jasmine's highest be? 35, but price is 34. Makes no sense. Makes, makes no sense at all. Uh, because in the layout and everything, uh, Jasmine comes before, uh, price, because he needs Surf in order to get over there. So it's like, oh, you just get Surf, Go to Chuck, do that, come back, do Jasmine, and then you move on over. So it's like, why, why go to Price and come back? It's like, you're just right there. Um, I think what we'll do, because uh, let me look up uh, Claire. Claire's highest is 41. Uh, so I think what we'll do is we'll go up to 35. Yeah, we'll go up to 35. No, we don't want to thrash. Number 35 will fight Jasmine. Because here's the thing, like... What is a Gastro Acid? Oh. Yeah, no. Hopefully we can find a Moonstone. Which I really want to do the King it. We're now at the point where... Nah. So now we're at the point where... If we can evolve them, like, they're gonna learn really good moves. Single Beam... Nah. Don't wanna learn that. The, uh, ooh, Fire Fang. Fire Fang is gonna be really good. Uh... Sorry, we're gonna get rid of Hal. As much as I would love to keep... Keep it. Fire Fang is gonna be too good. Alright, then we do Aerosmith. Get, ooh, Crunch. Uh, yeah, one more physical. Sorry, we'll get rid of that. All right, Jasmine time. <clears throat> Cause, oh boy. Oh, we don't fight them. I, <laughs> I got scared. Cause I was like, man, it'd be great to just have to go straight in, fight Jasmine. That's it. I thought for some reason, cause in my brain, it's like, oh yeah, I learned recently that, uh, in the development for. Uh, Gold Silver Crystal, like, 
you were gonna have it to where you could fight other trainers, like, put up, go to, like, a second floor and then fight Jasmine or whatever. But you got cut at some point, so you just go and fight Jasmine, that's it. I forgot about that and just went, oh, damn, we have to fight people now? Holy crap. Totally forgot all about that. Forgot all about it. So now we're fighting Jasmine, who is actually Thomas. And yeah, three. Oh my god. I had to take a fucking gamble with that. I had to take a giant gamble with that. Hey, this is your ace. Line noon. That was very close. Iron tail. Oh my god. I mean, would it would it have sucked if you lost uh, Marowak? A, a little, yeah. A, a, a little, not gonna lie. Ah, uh, but... Whew. Two patches in one episode. Let's go, baby. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, so... Let's make our way back over to... Air critique. Um, oh, there's an item right there. How the hell do you get it over there? There's a way to. Over there. Oh, is that rock line thing? Oh, Moonstone. Ooh, Premier Ball. We'll take it. All right, we'll take that from your Ball. That's gonna help us out quite a bit, actually. All right, run on over to here, because now we can get a couple more encounters. Route 42, meaning we go into the water. We can get a cave encounter. And Mount Mortar. I mean, they're kind of low level, so... Yeah. I mean, uh, Surskit, not bad, not ideal. Nice, I've done away. Nice, primary bug. Uh, when you get a mask and rain, primary bug as well. So awesome. Awesome, I'll take it. Uh... What do we name it? Um... Let's name you Burn from from Free Red. Gonna name you Fern. Alright, so now we get a water and encounter. Route 42. I think primary electric, which means you should be able to take this. Okay, good, good. 
Hey, right, very good. Hell yeah! Hell yes! Ooh, we gotta serve the primary electric baby. Let's go! Hell yeah! Hell to the yes! <clears throat> God damn, this is going good. Uh, let's see, Magnemite. Uh, what is the name of Surge? Why not? Because Surge had a Magnemite. Good old Surge. Oh, hi! Hi, sweet coon! Moonstone! Uh, it's a miracle seed. In which we already have one. Alright. Uh, whoops. Ooh, protector? Wait a minute! There it is. I think if we can find a ride on and we give it that and level up, we could get ourselves a ride carrier. And that's gonna be awesome. Oh, I. I was under the impression you would have given me a, uh. a fishing rod. Um, but I guess I was wrong. Oh, that's rock line, that's right. Unfortunately, this is still Route 42. Yeah, what, what would have been a request encounter, just, just out of curiosity? Oh, man, a Scroopy, that actually would have been kind of good. If I'm being completely honest, like, a Skorupi would have been pretty good. But, yeah. Uh, I think what we'll end up doing really quick is we will. We'll do the shiny uh, in the Lake of Rage. Route 43. But yeah. Uh, other than that, um, let's see, what else was there? Um, <gasps> yeah! Oh, wow! Uh, you're level 15, but. Okay. Come on. Come on. I can't even attack you. <gasps> yes! Oh my god, that's a primary fire! Yes! Oh my god! Man, we're getting so many good encounters this episode! Holy crap! Oh my god, yes! Oh, we're gonna name you Ken. At their Street Fighter. Oh my god, we need to figure out... We need to see what... What Magnemite's ability is, what Blaziken's ability is. Um... Okay, I'm gonna need to turn, thank you. Alright, Lake of Rage! And the shiny... I guess it's not like Gyarados, but it will be a different kind of shiny. 
so... Let's see, how many balls do we have again? Uh, 9 great, 10 ultra, 1 fast, and 3 premier. Yeah, I'm not, I don't care about Burgly. Because... I'm, 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 I'm... I'm, I'm doing a veto, I'm making rules right now. The shiny is our, like, a rage to counter. I, I already settled on that. It doesn't matter what else I get. And besides, I wasn't get, gonna catch that Brogly anyway. I don't care about it. Even if it did have a, a good ability, like, man, I don't care about it. Uh, but... Shiny time! Hey, primary, uh, steel. Uh, so... We could use it. Oh, I can't Thunder Wave it. Yeah. Wait a minute. It has Motor Drop? <laughs> okay. Oh, right. Uh... Cool. Um... Hmm. Yeah, you shouldn't live with it. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Yes! Primary Steel. Let's go. Uh, I mean, we already have Taco. We'll do <laughs> we have Taco when you have a bell. Alright, Red Scale. Awesome. Hi, Lance. Bye. I'm a I'm a walk down there real quick. I went the wrong way. Uh, Aerosmith. Yes, Ravon. Swap for Taco. So we'll go back to uh, Mahogany. Mahogany, we'll save. Oh, wait, we could have a bubble pass. Hold on. I need to make my way over to that item. I need to know what is what it is. And Moonstone. Ah, brick mail. Math. Nah. Eh. But man, we got some really good encounters this episode. I'm happy with it. Holy crap. Oh my god. Heal up real quick. Alright, we're gonna look at abilities real quick. Cause I, I need to know what they are. You're... I mean, we could have done it, like, back in the other menu, but I just haven't noticed it, but we're here already. Uh, so we know Leo has Intimidate. Maybe Fern has Shield does, which... Okay, he's gonna change when it evolves later. Uh, Shucky, again, like I said, has huge power, which is badass, I love it. Uh... Oh, it's God damn it, Surge. You have cast forms ability. 
which is useless on you. So whenever you evolve, uh, it'll change, so that's good. Uh, Ken? What are the odds? Ken has this normal ability. <laughs> That's amazing. How did it get randomized to its own ability? That's amazing. And then, of course, Bell has motor drive. Which, that's, that's the funny thing, is that I tried to use Spark against it, and it didn't do any damage, which is funny. So, I had to get done raising its speed, so it probably could have crit us and killed us if it really wanted to. Yeah, we have, we have our shiny, so yay! We got some really good encounters this episode. We got two patches, lots of, lots of Pokemon. Uh, Polyglag with Drizzle, like, that's actually really good. Um, so everyone's up to 35, which we will take on the, the Rocket Hideout, we'll take on Price, and maybe we'll go through the, uh, the cave on our way to, uh, to Blackthorn. So, we got a lot done this episode, and I am happy. This run, total opposite of what happened last episode. So this turned everything around. We had some good encounters. We got a lot done. Huge power fucking Pidgeot. I am all for that, baby. Hell yeah. So... Again, thank y'all very, very much for watching. Hope you had a great time watching this episode as well. Thank you very, very much. If you did watch all the way through, you're awesome. Thank you. Uh, but that being said, though, if you didn't enjoy it, don't forget to leave a like, comment, sub, and all that good stuff. Enjoy the rest of the episodes and all the other stuff on the second channel. And I will catch you next week for episode 7. Later. And bye. Peace.